good my youtube family was popping like how y'all doing i'm back of course again with another video now today i'm gonna be talking about how to survive jiho now for all of you out there that don't know what jiho is jiho is basically the greatest homecoming on earth if you go to ANC, you already know what it is you already know what's popping like come on you already know well for us our homecoming g slash jiho starts next week well actually starts this coming sunday so our homecoming is not like just for the weekend it lasts from sunday to sunday so like the turn up really does not stop until after it's over i mean if we're being real and if you really go to ant you know the turn up never really stops but anyways yeah so today i'm gonna tell y'all how to like basically survive jiho so let's go ahead and get the video started get it so number one make sure you go to class going to class is very important like just because you know you got moves going from sunday to sunday does not mean that you need to skip class okay people you need to go to class even sometimes your professor they like give extra credit sometimes so i mean who doesn't love extra credit when you rarely ever get it so yeah please go to class also knock out all your assignments at least try to do it like a week in advance if you can possibly two weeks and if not just knock it out before you out at the turn up because you don't want to be at the turn up like hey, hey, or whatever doing your little thing getting it popping or whatever and you realize that you got an assignment dude like that would be so embarrassing so like yeah make sure you go to class and handle your business okay okay number two people buy all your event tickets in advance like come on now people we trying to be like walmart you know save money live better okay buy your tickets in advance people usually where well, the promos teams or whatever usually start promoting the parties like a month or two months in advance so as soon as you see then promoting, go ahead and get with your friends. Be like, hey, we, hey, hey, girl, like, um, yeah, we're going to this and we're going to that. Make sure y'all go ahead and get y'all tickets, um, you know, in groups. Go ahead and make sure y'all know what y'all going to and whatnot in advance. Because usually when you wait, tickets at the door could go from like forty dollars to like fifty. So I mean, who wants to spend fifty dollars when everybody else in the turn up and only pay twenty? Like, really? Yeah, really. Okay, number three. Make sure you know how you're getting to the turn up or to the little event, whatever. I know I keep saying turn up, but you know what I mean. Make sure you know how you get in there and how you get in bed. Now, it's very important that you know this. Okay, number four, make sure that you be aware at all times. Now, camp is about to be swamped with people like, it's about to be people over here, over there, over there, over there. It's about to be people everywhere. So, make sure that you are aware at all times, especially when you at the club or a party or whatever make sure you're just paying attention to your surroundings because everybody does not have your best intentions so please be aware of that also number five turn up before you get there please do not take drinks from strangers don't turn up with strangers during jiho it's very important that you just have your own you know provide your own turn up and don't try to like you know get everybody else's i mean just it's just safer to have your own that way you already know nobody's spiking your drink blase blase you know how it go i mean come on now like you're adults now you should know how this go but anyways yeah so just make sure that you turn up before you get there and you know it's cool if you want to you know bring it with you but don't do it at the event like don't get any drinks or anything at the event just you know provide your own okay also I almost forgot this is really important if you and your friends are all gonna be turning up at least make sure that you have one person who's the DD and which is you know the designated driver this also relates back to the transportation thing um yeah make sure that somebody if y'all all gonna be turning up at least make sure that one person out of your group is going to sober up before it's time to go because you need to make sure that y'all get from a to b safely and nothing happens to neither one of y'all now if one person say you know they ready to go or they tripping a little too much then all y'all need to go everybody needs to go in a pack do not go to any event or leave any event alone that is a no like that's a big okay no. guys so basically so, that sums up the video i hope that you all have a safe and fun g turn up have fun and
enjoy yourself. Um, like I said, just keep the, please keep these tips in mind. I hope that I helped you all today, but keep these tips in mind and basically enjoy yourself. And, and if you see me during G, you'll say, what's up, man? what's good, Ace? And I'm gonna be like, ah. Yeah, anyways. 